swipe on all of you. What that in the fuck? <laughs> fuck is this fit, bro? I'm the shortest. So. Oh, bro, missing the whole leg. Honestly, I was. You can tell which one got little dicks, though. What did you say? Because two of them got shorts on. Niggas ain't proud of their penis. Yeah. Oh. I'm looking at chess. You have the biggest chest as well. Oh, thank you. Yes. Wow. Was... The fuck? Bro got titties, and that's how they judging it. So so gym, you right? two would like go like I one feel and like two. It's definitely like me. one and two. Yeah. yeah, exactly. My leg does play a huge role in my um, confidence in myself, and that's a big reason why I'm so heavily tattooed is to. It's all right, as long as you got that third leg, bro. You can be missing a leg, but you got another leg to withhold with that leg. Draw more attention um, away from my leg. You are going over there. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go. You two definitely <laughs> go over there. Just, okay. What side do you want me on? You are the, way bigger than your, you got the arms. Uh, basically. Bro, bro kind of sexy though, I ain't gonna lie. So he, he should definitely Hemsworth be over there. Over there. <laughs> <laughs> I say v Vashon. Okay. Those calves. I think, yeah. Big. I feel like Tony might be Nigga, he got ankle socks, zebra ankle socks at that, nigga. Put that nigga at the last spot, Mo. Be number two. Just because I feel like if you lost the weight, Nick, you'd be more defined just because you go to the gym. I could tell you have muscle, but I think you have just more like average body, I'd say. I'll take Everyone it. else agree? I would put you number or two in terms of body. I feel like I do look like the most average out of everybody here, so I'm okay with that. Average isn't a bad thing. It's hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, like why, why this nigga right here got a permanent arch? Like, why is he arched permanently? He got the peacock build. Like, I don't, I don't like that. Put that nigga at the end, too. Very bad advice. I just got four years sober, so um, it's the gym is like my stress reliever. Three times a week, I try to get at least three in, and then, like, an activity of some sort, whether that be, like, basketball or just something yeah. along those lines. Based see, on at that, least my boy making should... progress. Because we Number can see two. it. We can see that you work out. Yeah. So How did... Being out I, there, yeah. Me personally, I, I really can't see it. Not I don't great. know what they're looking at. <laughs> hey, good humans. It's Zach. You can okay, Zach. You can usually find nutrients in my body. A little what help from a nutritional <laughs> drink called bro. AG1. Every morning, I make sure I'm getting all the necessary nutrients Yo, that I needed to keep up. My bro started wilding. <laughs> Stop. Uh -huh. No. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that nigga. This man right here, he need to go all the way at the end. What the fuck? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I'm feeling that jacket, though. I fuck with that jacket, but that this not a nigga jacket. Bro got a long ass skirt on, bro. Like this nigga half Amish, half dot. Uh, I am very plain. I, I don't think I have a style. This is just gym shorts and a t-shirt. You should be number one. Okay, I think I'll take that. that. Uh, definitely the most flashy. No I, I think it works. <laughs> Where does your style come from, George? At some point, I got really tired of like trying to force myself to be accepted by other guys. Man. Bro said accepted by other guys, accepted by anybody, bro. If I see you, I'm crossing the street, nigga. That fucking style, nigga. You look like you chucked me out with them damn boots. And in skirts. And bro, I ain't gonna lie. He got the most basic style ever. This man right here, he, he got a basic ass style. So he be in like third. This nigga, what the fuck is that, bro? What the fuck is that? Bro got the dot shirt on. You know when you showing them when you showing them um them little I don't even know what the fuck these shits is called, but when you showing them shits, you ready to get dick down, bro. Put this nigga at the end. And bro, he got a regular style too. So he could go on like like third. This nigga, uh this nigga could go on first. Nah nah, he, he he I ain't gonna lie, his shit his shit kinda icy though. I'm feeling a little, Nick got the BB belt on too. Like, what he know about that? Bro, a little bit fly. I, I'm not feeling a crop top though, bro. Like, your rose is getting caught in your fucking belt, bro. Kid Cudi, queer men, trans men, women, a lot of women inspire me. Like, I feel like you are inspired by lesbian women. I'm inspired by my girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> yo, you, yo. Telling the nigga. <laughs> How you tell a nigga he dressed like a fucking lesbian, bro? <laughs> Yo, what? He dressed like a 12-year-old, though. And, bro, I don't... I, I dare this nigga to tell me anything about fashion, bro. The, the fit he got on is unacceptable. Like, 
Bro got on a biker skirt. I would switch you two because you both have acceptable, like, guy, like, he looks good fashion, but I like the color. Yeah, you, you definitely put some more earth to it. Yeah, bro, his fit is better than... Like, I, I put... I don't know. These sneakers put you down a lot of fucking points, bro. Only because his feet stole. Them bitches is wheezing when he walk. Feel bro. more beautiful and this attractive. This nigga got a bedazzled fucking dot shirt on right now. I think I'd love to see you in a long skirt, though. Like a flowy one, too, that you can run in. I'll give it a shot. Bro, don't, don't let this fucking nigga... Don't, don't let him convince you to do any of that bullshit, bro. Yeah, you pick up my next outfit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, we're all good <laughs> thrifting after this. No. <laughs> no, bro. No. I want to change myself to switching with Nick. Just because. Bro, what's good? <laughs> Why he leaning in so far, bro? I'm telling you, he got dead bodies in his basement. Like, I could tell. Because, like, based off of style as well, like, I know you're shocked right now, but, like, the thing is, is that, like, you can you can see this as style, but I see you as style. I really... I Yo, what do you mean? Really so that's why, that's why. Okay. <laughs> he volunteers to shoot Bro, yeah. he got good style, bro. Like, he got the green with the green. Like, I don't know what this bullshit is. And this thing, he, he matching, I guess. It's really the skirt. Like, if he had some jeans with them high-ass boots, I, I don't know. It's the fact that he look like a bad bitch right now. Bro, confusing me sexually. Appreciate it. Uh, yeah. We are not our clothes. Like, yeah, yeah. You like that, yeah. Yeah. It's way what you want. It's you know, an yeah. attitude. Yeah. yeah. Hold on. Like, yeah, yeah. You like that, yeah. Yeah. Why the fuck is this nigga up here? He should not be up here. He should not be here. Put this nigga at the back, bro. It's way what you want. It's, you know, an attitude. Yeah. yeah. If you thought like this is a very masculine person, who's like your prime example of? The first person that comes to mind is my stepdad. Um, he really stepped up and took my mom in when she was sick and took in two stepsons, my brother and myself. He has cried in front of me. He has cried in front of my mom. Masculinity was taught to me as pretty much just an absence of emotion. I knew that that was wrong, so I've just been like masculinity, femininity, it's not even real, we're just taking traits that all humans can have and applying a word to it. Yeah. So I don't know where I stand. I'd like to just throw myself at the end. I'll go to oh. you. <laughs> I don't like the modern don't version of masculinity. Uh, what the fuck is going on now? We having a sausage fest now. Yeah. So I wouldn't okay. associate myself yeah. with it. Obviously you are very influenced by your stepdad. For sure. And if that is your definition of masculinity, and that's the healthiest definition I've ever heard, you deserve to be here. But understood both sides of the spectrum. They're Yo, what's going on, bro? These niggas about to start making out or some shit? Bro, come on. We supposed to be judging niggas by style, not by fucking life experiences, bro. Well, I think your upbringing and your way of seeing things makes you deserve this spot. I like that you said too, you were like, I'm still working on it. If you had told us that like, no, you're the perfect one already, you've achieved <laughs> masculinity, then you wouldn't deserve the top spot. No one will ever be like a perfect man, but that mindset will make you a perfect man. Cause like, okay, I don't like this video is fucking losing me, bro. I don't know what the fuck this shit turned into, bro. Um, and I don't have a lot of I came on this video. I wanted niggas to call each other ugly and cut each other ass, but they talking about their feelings, bro. And then I got um my scar from when I busted my lip um playing tag on crutches like a couple of months after my amputation. I think I'm lower on the end for sure. I had to and say I, I nah, think scars are high there for a second. <laughs> How the fuck was he playing tag with one leg, bro? nigga is yo he really he really is masculine yeah, 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 yeah. i don't know like you guys both have very nice skin and so that's why i think you yo, guys are you do too. well thank you but <laughs> you seem so uncomfortable with ah. the idea yo why bro, bro rizzing him up <laughs> you better fuck this nigga <laughs> you better have that one all right let me stop of being how do you guys feel where do you think you belong i think i'm higher okay i mean i don't, don't want to be narcissistic so bro handsome bro he, he could go up high, no homo though. No homo. If there's ever a time to be narcissistic, I didn't know. I can look at you and I could see myself getting lost in your eyes. You have very pretty eyes. Oh, there you go. You, have, you don't have to do too much. Like, you're just attractive. So I would like to place you here to my right. Sounds good. You know. <laughs> and I got made fun of a lot in middle school and in high school, and even now, like on the internet, that people think I have features of someone who has Down syndrome. Because